Hey, what's up, everyone? This is gonna be a shockwave game, zero hour shockwave. And I am. Oop. Wrong one. I am. This is GLA, and I'm trying to nuke general. So I always usually do two dozers. And I'm a standard um, $10,000 um, start money. Like a lot of Captain Command and Conquer games are. Now when they got the barracks up, make some red guard and then building is complete. And then get the um engineer upgrade. It's like a um building capture upgrade for you that don't know this game. So want to get that. I notice the game doesn't start off with radar. So you gotta build radar. So I need to get a war factory. And I usually had everything hotkey. I forgot some of the hotkeys. All I really the hotkeys do is get your buildings up a little bit faster. And select units a little bit faster. So I'm gonna build a radar so we can see what we're doing. I get my windows over here, expand. Upgrade complete. Now I'm gonna get show you guys some siege soldiers. Upgrade complete. We stand together! Uh, here's a nuclear battle master. It's kind of like the um, zero hour version of the battle master. Has the horde bonus, of course. Horde bonus is when you're together, you actually fight better because you're like in a team. Get the oil here, there's the oil back here. Got this. And the last time I. And this computer could actually put up a fight. Now I'm going to show you a, a, um, a desolator tank, it's got an RAD tank, a radar tank, a boom expand. I want to mix... I might as well... Actually, I'm just going to capture this. Sometimes it's better to capture the enemy oils than blow it up, even if you only have it for a little while. It's, it's kind of weird. I'm going to fast tank, I guess. Now watch this guy. It's a desolated tank. And I might might want to get this on me. Watch this. Boom boom. It shoots like kinda like desolation beams. Boom boom boom. And now, if I go like this, eject nuclear waste. Please. And watch this. Boom boom. I put up two different things. Now watch. Wait, 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 wait. There it goes. Yeah, eject nuclear waste. A mammoth devastator is like a tank destroyer. It's really strong. No, I don't want the computer to um, expand too much. The computer is on medium right now, but it is actually capable of defeating me, believe it or not. I actually have another game where um, why I didn't upload because the game got messed. Oh, I gotta start making more stuff. Duh. She's a devastator, it's like a tank destroyer. Look at these guys, the um missile launchers. Sea soldiers. Now one thing I gotta remember is I'm gonna put a base defense up so I can show you guys most of the weapons. Try to show you most of the weapons and if I I might not get through all the weapons. Now I'll show you a regular MIG and a nuclear MIG. This, I don't know what the reason is to get this meek when they got a better meek. So, I mean, this one just seems. The better meek seems altogether the superior. We are the red God. Okay, so, getting the oil. I better get a lot of infantry, so. He just killed my dozer when I was building, I think. And both are actually an expansion. I think, I think, um, I don't really get those. Okay, so let's watch the Desolator tank again. It has two different, three different attacks. Basic attack, as you see right here. Boom, boom. See, I'm attacking at the ground. Eject nuclear rest. And it, like, blows up. And then a core. Watch, so it's like, boom. You gotta go away from your base or to blow up everything in your base. I'm gonna make some more tanks, by the way. So I don't get killed by the computer. And I gotta get some infantry to back up my tanks. 
the nuclear waste. Okay, let me try it again. No, I'm just gonna explode. You got you gonna zap him? Oh no, radiation tank. It actually hurts my own shit. I gotta be more careful. Oh, watch this. This is a regular meek? Wait, I should do the new meeks. Meeky route. It's kind of like a little bit of a carpet bomb, but not really a full carpet bomb. It's a lot better. Um, so yeah, my goal is to show, try to show you most of the weapons. Um, this listen on post sim similar to Zero Hour. Okay, he's gonna take his oil back. I want to make him stop him from expanding right here. Is this? Oh, he already did, huh? I will take the red flag. Nuclear no, if I could uh, get that, it'd be good. Let's get yeah, it's basically a stealth tank going to thing, thing, but they're not very good because these tanks are not like infantry generals. Infantry general has the best listening output, so I don't really get these unless I need a detector. And they're really like not as good as the other units overall. It, I mean, it's got detection, it does what it's supposed to do, but. Alright, uh, sell this, just make sure he doesn't get too much money. I notice that this tank's coming out of here. I'm gonna get the horde bonus, and I gotta, I gotta remember to upgrade that guy. Okay, now I wanna actually... Propaganda Center. Oops. Here we go. I gotta tech up. It's like a battle lab, propaganda center. Yeah, this thing is so strong, this Devastator tank. It's, it really does a lot of damage. It just smashes tanks so bad. It's really awesome. Whoa. What the? Oh, shit. I hit my nuclear nuclear waste thing. These things? It's kind of like the GLA thing, but it's way stronger. Yeah, I think I better do these in the enemy base. Eject nuclear waste. I don't want to mess around with that crap anymore. But this one just explodes. Watch. Boom. Get out of here. Alright, it's just gonna boom, boom. Got a lot of the tanks right there. So I guess the Devastate. Best weapon so far. Upgraded Battle Master is not that. Oh, that's good, I guess. I could suicide watch this, watch. Okay, I'll show you something the battle master can do. It's got some extra speed. Oh, these guys don't kill him first. You could suicide, kind of like a demo truck. Oh, it's not gonna do anything to the stinger shot, but I'll just show you what it what it does. Yeah, it blows up a little bit, a little bit like a weak demo truck. So you could use them as suicide, go on suicide missions with them. I didn't really get a good hit on them right there, but you get the idea. So, China boom, nuclear missile. I might as well get a nuclear missile because this game's gonna drag out for a while. Computer doesn't really go down easily. I never get this upgrade. This um, cash hack is just stupid. Okay. Um. I don't gotta watch this. I know he's right here, so I'm just gonna bomb it. Oh, watch. Boom, boom. This is a regular. I know the balloon bombers. I'm going to need air defense to stop them. Let's watch this explosion real quick. Notice how I have a lot of money. I'm not. I'd be having three or four war factories or something if I was playing against a human. But, yeah, see, those are pretty awesome. A tele barrage. Oop. There's a really tele barrage. This is the second one. And this is a cluster nuke. It's, it's a little bit weaker than a regular nuke. Okay, and this is the tradition of China. All the Chinese armies and generals in Zero Hour have this guy. Well, I think most, except for the, except for the ones that are, um, actually I meant to say like all generals have it, but um, some of the armies doesn't have it in Zero Hour. But this is a back, 
Same thing as in general. Nuke. Nuke launcher. Now I want to. You look lost. And uh, the thing that's a little bit annoying about the computer, these thing are so. Calibrating the base defenses in Zero Hour are much stronger than regular 2's base defenses. It See, it, it does more damage to tanks and units in base defenses. If you know, like, if you play Yuri's Revenge. Sorry if I'm talking too loud. If you play like zero use defense, you know that the base defenses are, aren't that weak. They're more for like a, they absorb a bullet for like the, for like the army and stuff. Over against rhinos versus grizzly tanks. I'm just collecting the army right here. Oh, I didn't get this. But yeah, these base defenses, they're, they're really, really strong. I make sure he does them. Put him in guard mode. You gotta shoot from a range or these things will blow up your own tanks. No, I really like this nuclear bomb upgrade. Which is called a nuke bomb. It's not a full, it's not a full nuke, it's just a... You should call it a cluster nuke or something. Uh oh. I don't wanna lose my propaganda center, what the hell? Okay, so yeah, I basically got the, the, the ground mostly control. I'll show you this. Yeah, these things have bombs just like, uh, you can put them on anything. I don't want to put them on my own tank, but they're not going to make it to these base defenses. These are stinger sites. These uh, tunnel networks. They're not going to make it, but it's hard to get, um, it's actually a song. Ooh. Oh shit, my nuclear cannons are too strong. They're gonna blow up my own things. Good thing I got some Gatling cannon. I notice in generals, you don't get this horde, this horde bonus with these Gatling cannons. Now watch this. Yeah, I want to show you a competitive game with this, but I'm gonna show you just as it's a just game for now. I'm just gonna bomb this guy. Since he's alone, he's not gonna kill me. This is a terrorist. I just bombed this thing. These balloon bombers are gonna get me though. See? Yeah, but you, the balloon bombers, the, they got low armor, but they're very strong and they're hard to hit because they're in the air. Where I mean, of course, you need air defense. Um, I'm getting tons of these. It seems like the nuclear battle master is self destruct is slightly weaker than zero hours. I know they make every weapon stronger in the mod. But I remember like when I ran up on the tunnel network, I did more damage than I'm doing right now. I notice if you go straight, you start to pick up more speed with the battle master. See? Yeah, it's a little bit weaker. It's actually kind of kind of surprising. I think I, I don't really have any other upgrades. Though. See, boom, boom. Neutron bomb, EMP upgrade, neutron bomb, journalist promotion. So I could get that. You know, I don't really want that crap right now. It's just Superman mode. Minefield. You guys already know what a minefield is, so I'm ready to show that. So, yeah, let's move in for an attack. This is and I always put them in guard mode because they only fire in guard mode for the for these tanks. I might as well get my battle masters over here. Alright, I got them over there. So boom, boom, boom. Let's see if I could. Uh, let's see if I did. I get the bomb jacket. I think I did. I think I. Saw. Oh, that's the balloon bombs are no chance. Oh look, upgraded nationalism, she does a yellow circle. That means my battle masters, my battle masters could rock and roll now. I'm just gonna blow up these base defenses for now.
And you need vision for some weapons in order to shoot. Oh, yeah, right. The Stinger sight's a little stronger than the Tunnel Network. But the Tunnel Network usually comes with two RPG troopers. So. Yo, yeah, I want to show you that Superman mode. Superman mode! Watch this. Bam, 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 bam! Give him rapid fiber. Super rapid fire. Boom, 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 boom. Uh oh. Something hit me. I hate when they do that. Do they have advanced demo traps? It's really weird. Why are they that strong? Come on, nuke him. It's not gonna kill him right off because he's got a, he's got two bases right now. Now watch this. Yeah, that's the real nuke. Dude, that, that's the real nuke. The other ones are just like cluster nukes and stuff. Let's see if it makes a mushroom cloud. A little bit of a mushroom cloud, there you go. Hey, I gotta made a, made a little mushroom cloud, I guess. And the radiation, it, it does damage after the nuke is done. Select target. I don't know, it's these guys. He only has one thing over here. When I could, oh, God, you could get tactical nukes? Technical nuke Meigs? I'm not sure if it only upgrades the regular Meigs or the... Uh, China's oh, the, um, upgrade, oh, the oh, new Meigs. I'm not sure. Right, so. Foster nuke right there? Yeah, man. But imagine, this is just China nuke general. If you're playing against Air Force general, it's just total massacre of everything you've ever seen in your life. China general? Okay, so I want to make a big army and then finish them off. Boom. Nuclear Overlord. I, okay, you guys gotta see this, man. ECM tank, similar to a regular general's ECM tank. Um, it was, I'm gonna make some more. I got a lot of money. I can make. Of course, hacker centers like it reveals raid on you. Put your hackers in there. Black loaders, I could get them hackers. So I mean, I don't really, totally un like I don't really use these sea soldiers too much because I'm. I didn't play this game a super lot. Oops, I don't want that up there. Okay. Yeah, notice this. This nuclear overlord cannot get the, um. The, um. The one upgrade. The upgrades are different for this. Now, I want to try to get some games in game range and with me up. Plane versus people on this. But some of the people are noobs, some are good. So. Playing against hard is harder than playing against most people on this. And I hack. And you can hack suitcase neck. It, like, it can be triggered on enemies. I, I, I tried it. I don't think it's that amazing. Yeah, but what I was saying, tactical nukes. You don't have a Gatlin up upgrade. I think in zero hour you you can't you just can't build the um the bunker. But I think in this one you can. They change it up from zero hour a little bit. The way you upgrade your um nuclear biomasters. Now I used to think that um this is one. And don't don't forget that um. My battle masters, they have like a, a little bit of toxic corrosion in the bullets. See? See a little puff puff of fire? It's like nuclear stuff, it does extra, extra damage. Let's overload, take all over this. Oh, that's a new upgrade. It has like a missile on top instead of a gag cannon. Interesting. So it looks like he's doing a, an ambush. Might have been a rebel ambush right there. Okay. Our power is low. Let's build. Why don't I have power if I have this? Look at all these upgrades they just showed. Radiation shoots. Boom, boom, boom. Isotope stability, same as zero hour. Um, it stops it from harming myself. 
That's just an old word, that's new. So, this is the best mod I think for Zero Hour. I think there's a couple other ones that are pretty good though that I haven't ever played. So, boom, I'm gonna finish them off. Ah. Uh, they got some kind of demo trap that's doing crazy amount of damage to me. I don't I don't know what the hell it is. Okay, I'm gonna bomb this guy over here. And notice how I'm going in ground attack mode. Yeah. Zero hour I mean zero hour is hard to get to a point where there's too many super weapons down in the army. But I mean this this game is like a little bit too much bomb and not enough army, but I don't know man. I will take care of it. Gotta make sure they don't be rebuilt so I go get this game won. Artillery Barrage was always my favorite for China. I mean, it's all, it, in, in regular generals, it's really probably one of the best upgrades you could get. I mean, of course, the five star the five star upgrades are always the best EMP pulse and Nuke Bomber. I guess Nuke Bomber is just a, a little bit better. Carpet Bomber, it looks, it's, it looks like. I gotta get an army and, and take them out over here. So. Need to transfer. Is it clear? Oh, and by the way, I just think the Gatlin cannon upgrades are better than the Nuke Bombers because you gotta be right above them and stuff. The Gatling cannon is ready. This is the Overlord. So I'm gonna blow up his base defense, then he has really nothing. Yeah, these scaling tank cannons are really the weapon to are the right weapon to upgrade. The mother of all weapons. Green is good. Green is good. Yeah, nuclear MIGs are really freaking phenomenal. Yeah, they rebuild so fast in this game. I'm shooting him and he's rebuilding as fast as I can shoot him. Yeah, I'm gonna nuke him. I'm gonna throw everything I had at him. I gotta get out of here because the nuke could kill me. Can't see shit. <laughs> Too many bombs. Gotta take out these buildings and the computer should just resign. I don't know why it doesn't. Okay, this should be it. What do you need? I think this is it. Not one hundred percent sure. See if there's anything over here. I got a hacker way over here. Okay, got him. Computer should resign with like one or two buildings, we but are victorious. yeah, that's most of the armies. And on hard, it's really more difficult than this. And hard, I'll be struggling just to even win.